Storage Battery Systems, your source for testing equipment. Introducing the SBS 8400 Load Bank. Load bank testing is a way of verifying the correct operational performance and capacity of the battery system. The SBS 8400 Load Bank allows you to maintain compliance with NERC and IEEE standards. Programming and control of the SBS 8400 Load Bank is done on the color touch screen LCD. The SBS 8400 load bank was designed to make testing of battery systems much more efficient. The SBS 8400 has a much wider operating range from 10 to 300 volts DC and 0 to 120 amps. Because the SBS 8400 is such a flexible unit, it can replace having to purchase multiple units for different voltages. The SBS 8400 can operate in parallel with our S series of load banks. This means you can use the SBS 8400 as a master load and parallel other load banks in to increase the total discharge current capacity. The SBS 8400 also has wireless battery monitoring technology, allowing quick test setup and avoiding hundreds of feet of test wires. It comes with an advanced analysis software program that allows for real-time communications, data capture, and display on a PC during testing. The SBS 8400 also stores all of the data internally for downloading to USB memory device for manual transfer to a PC at a later time. The software is also capable of generating detailed graphic reports for reviewing or printing. These features make load bank testing much more efficient, accurate, and capable of reporting detailed battery system and individual cell analysis. Prior to turning on the SBS 8400, it is necessary to make all of the main machine connections. First, connect the red positive and black negative cables to the power connectors and bolt the test cables onto the main positive and negative of the battery string to be tested. Use the alligator clips to connect the data collection modules to the batteries. Refer to the user manual to follow the proper module connection. Now that all the main connections have been made, we can start up the SBS 8400 by turning on the AC power switch on the front of the unit. A welcome screen will appear. Touching anywhere on the screen will bring up the main menu. Press discharge in the main menu to enter the parameter interface. You can enter the parameters here and select apply to save them. Up to eight preset discharge profiles can be saved and reused for tests of the same type and quantity of batteries. Press start to enter the discharge interface and then press start again to begin discharging the battery string. Follow the commands on the screen to connect the load to the batteries and initiate the test. You may manually stop the discharge by pressing pause to pause the discharge or stop to end the discharge. Pressing start will continue the discharge. Pressing param during the discharge will allow you to change parameters if needed. Now that the discharge testing is done, we'll review the testing results. Now we will demonstrate the real-time data feature of the SBS 8400 with a direct feed to a computer connection. On the main menu, select the battery view interface. If all wireless modules are connecting correctly, you will see the voltage of each battery displayed. If the voltages of some batteries are not showing correctly, check the wireless module's connections. The SBS 8400 provides two ways to record test data. You may use an RS-232 cable to connect the main machine with a PC. Through the analysis software, real-time test data is displayed and recorded during the test. The SBS 8400's internal memory also always saves all testing data. You can download the data later by USB disk or the RS-232 cable to the PC. To perform real-time recording during testing, connect the RS-232 cable from the main machine with the PC. On the software program, select Connect in the Detect menu to open the real-time monitoring link interface. Ensure that the data in the red highlighted fields is correct for the batteries you are testing as these are the numbers used to determine capacity calculations. We can now begin the discharge test. 
The real-time data will be displayed and updated automatically throughout the test and saved simultaneously to a file on the PC. To read data from the unit using the RS-232 connection, select the Read Data Through RS-232 button on the menu bar. This will import all of the stored data from the SBS-8400. If you transfer data to the supplied USB disk, you can see the data files by opening the Open Data Files folder icon on the menu bar. Select the proper drive ID for the USB device and the list of test results should appear. Click the file name to open the test data of the file you want to view. The main interface, you will see six windows that show all of the test information. You may generate a report simply by clicking the print icon in the software or save the data to a specific file name by clicking the Save File icon. It is important to use a correctly rated load bank unit while performing discharge tests. Here are all the different SBS load bank models. The SBS 8400 can be used in parallel with your existing load banks as well as by simply adding the optional external 600 amp current clamp. The SBS 8400 load bank is a very accurate, reliable, and highly functional tool for testing and capturing test results. The SBS S series load banks can be operated in parallel with the SBS 8400 or another S series load bank of the same voltage range to increase the load current capacity of the system.